On Android devices, permissions are everything. If you provide sensitive permissions to a rogue app, it will steal your valuable data. In this video, you will learn about 10 sensitive app permissions to avoid on Android to keep it safe. Before we start this guide, press the like button and subscribe to our channel in case you forget later. Why avoid app permissions? On Android devices, permissions allow applications to access the hardware features or personal information, such as a camera, microphone, storage, contacts, or location. When you install an app, it asks for permissions that it needs to function. For example, installing an app to capture images will ask for the camera and storage permissions. But if it asks permission to read contacts, send SMS, or manage calls, that's suspicious. Cybercriminals create fake apps that look useful. When users install the apps, they ask for sensitive permissions, and most users blindly allow the app to access sensitive data. Once the app gets permission, it can steal your passwords, credit card details, saved contacts, images, and live location. How to check app permissions. When you install the app and open it for the first time, it asks for permissions. You need to carefully observe each permission and allow only the one that the app needs. If it is asking for suspicious permissions, avoid installing the app. To check the permission of already installed apps, open the Play Store. Then tap on your profile icon. Tap on Manage Apps and Device. Go to the Manage section. Here, select Installed. Then open the apps one by one. Tap on About This App. Scroll down and tap on App Permissions. Here you can see the detailed permissions the app needs. Similarly, you can check the permissions of an app before installing it. 10 App Permissions to Avoid on Android Authenticate Accounts This is an extremely dangerous permission to give as it allows an app to authenticate sensitive information on your Android device like passwords. Giving a rogue app this access is asking for your password to get stolen. Read Sensitive Log Data You don't want just any application to read the sensitive log data on your Android phone or tablet. There have been cases where these malware-infested apps secretly mailed the log files of the phones back to their developer. These included keystrokes, which means that the credit card details, usernames and passwords that users type were also transferred. Read Contacts As it says on the tin, this permission gives an application access to your contact, letting it read all the details of these entries. This is the first thing that malware apps will ask for. If you allow them, they will take advantage of these details in a variety of ways, including sending malicious files to your contacts via spoofed emails. Read or write calendar data. Most users ignore this permission. If a rogue app gets access to your calendar data, it can create unwanted events and invite people from your contact list, so you should not give this permission to an app that doesn't need it. Read browser history and bookmarks. This one explains itself. Any app can track browsing habits using this permission. While there are legitimate uses of this permission like social apps or applications that sync or back up your data, still, take caution when enabling it. Write Secure Settings This permission allows an app to read and write system settings. Although Google doesn't let common apps ask for this permission, you should stay cautious if you often install apps from unofficial sites. If an app asks for this permission, remove it immediately. Process outgoing calls. This one is straightforward. Once granted this permission, the app will get the ability to monitor the details of outgoing calls. You should give this permission to genuine apps you use to make calls, such as VoIP apps. Send SMS. This is even more critical. Most online services use OTP to authenticate. A rogue app with access to your SMS can easily access your privileged accounts, so beware. Microphone. Apps like sound recorders, calling, cameras, and a few gaming apps need microphone access. Malware-infused apps may ask for microphone access to spy on you, so you should be aware when a suspicious app asks for this permission. Read Social Stream. Google incorporated permission that allows applications the ability to read information gleaned from your social feeds, so that suspicious apps can't access your social stream. You should only allow this permission for reputed social media apps. 
That's it for this video. If it does help you, press the like button and share the video with your friends. We keep uploading videos related to computer security, so subscribe to our channel and press the bell button to make sure you don't miss anything.